appears you're calling back into a live show. We are reconnecting you now. Your show will go live in five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Love Talk Radio.
crimes of the century. The 2018 People's Choice Awards Ball. Saturday, July 14th, 2018, in Charlotte, North Carolina. Doors open at 4 p.m. Awards with LSS because at 5 p.m. The first category for the 6th year, Charlotte. It makes $35 all night. Standard table, $250. Premier table, $300 for available. VIP table, $350. Six of the $1,000 for legendary performance. $1,000 female figure versus which queen both sex. $1,000 female figure versus which queen European runway. $1,000 female figure face. $500. Realness with a twist, $500. Book Queen American Runway, but much, much more. For more information, see the Facebook event page at Crimes of the Century. 2018, P3318. Crimes of the Century. The 2018 People's Choice Award Ball. Saturday, July 14th, 2018. girlfriends i am your girlfriends and let them know that she is here and we're back on live honey so i'm here for the shit honey this is another installment of motherfucking petty mondays where i can be as petty as i want i can talk all the shit i want all the shade i want and more honey if you want to be a part of these lives when they come on live, baby, make sure you go and you follow my fan page and you like my fan page so you can get notifications when I'm here for the shit, honey, because I don't go live from my page, from my main page anymore, only for exclusive things that I know where we're not going to carry and give much. I go and I give it to you from my regular page because if I give it to you from my regular page, baby, they will have me blocked. They would have me censored. They would try to cut my tongue out of my mouth and sit it on the table so I can't be here for the shit. So over here on the fan page where we have less moderation by Facebook, we can say what we want. We can do what we want. We can read how we want. And we can't get blocked, bitch. So guess what? It is Petty Mondays. We're here to talk about all the madness, all the drama, all the sweat, blood, and tears that the girls put into everything to go to Chicago this weekend for the Midwest Awards Ball, honey, okay? The girls was hot, honey. They was in there sweating. I sat and I watched the live from my room, and the girls said, bitch. We're in here sweating, honey. They said it looks like a motherfucking funeral, bitch. The girls was in there sweating with their fans. The girls had their fans out, mistake. I had my fan in my bag, mistake. They was fanning all night long, mistake. Girl, you see more fans than you see performances this weekend in Chicago. You see more fans than you see motherfucking categories at the Midwest Awards. Girl, they was fanning all night. They was hot. They were sweating for blood, Miss Thing Girl. Bitches was up in there in minks and furs and leather coats and all types of things, Miss Thing. Y'all should have been in y'all motherfucking, y'all should have been in y'all motherfucking skirts and y'all flip flops and y'all motherfucking shorts to be up in that motherfucker this weekend, cause bitch, 
They said it was the blood of Jesus up in that motherfucker, bitch, honey. Oh, Lord, honey. But yes, we're here to talk about all the shenanigans, all the fuckery and everything that has happened, Miss Bay, and all the fights, and bitches got ran over by cars, and all types the motherfucking madness that happened this weekend in Chicago. What I'm telling you, bitch, I was gagging at the tea that was going on, Miss Vegas. They said bitches got ran over by cars, Miss Vegas. Things, bitch. They said the children beat the children, honey. They said, the, they said, bitch, the Chanel's came from Detroit and thought that they was going to get it in, Miss Thing. Security said, I'm not here for the shit, Miss Thing, bitch. Oh, Lord. It's going down tonight. It's going down up in this motherfucker tonight. So, bitch, if you bitches think that we're gonna sit here all night and we're gonna read motherfucking comments, Miss Thing, bitch, get your motherfucking ass up out the motherfucking comment section, bitch, and get your motherfucking ass up on this motherfucking phone, bitch, and let bitches know that you here for the motherfucking shit, bitch, because you can't be here for the motherfucking shit, bitch, if you're gonna sit in the motherfucking comment section, bitch, get up out the motherfucking comment section, bitch, get up out those motherfucking bleachers, bitch, get up out those motherfucking pill pits, bitch, and stop. Stand the fuck up, bitch. Stand the fuck up, bitch, and let the girls know. Bitch, I'm here for the shit. 563-999-3792, bitch. And don't get no motherfucking better than this, honey. Everybody, welcome to the motherfucking radio show, bitch. The legendary motherfucking one and only his motherfucking self, bitch. Jason motherfucking Bridges, bitch. You're live on the air. You know my bitch, you can't motherfucking brace to that shit, bitch. Yes. Honey, I was good at that, honey. What's TJ say? <laughs> good evening, everyone. A good evening. Good evening. Share this live. Invite all your motherfucking friends to this live, bitch. Because it's going motherfucking down tonight, bitch. Get up out those bleachers, get up out those pew pits, get up out those stairs, and get up on this motherfucking phone, bitch. Everybody, welcome to the motherfucking radio show. It's the one, the only, the People's Choice Awards for, honey, coming to you July 14th in Charlotte, North Carolina, honey. It's just some motherfucking markets. It's live on the airwaves with us. <laughs> hey! Still dry, sir. No, 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 I'm not saying I know I'm just gagging. Y'all really are woke me up today. Baby, I'm waking this bitch up. Right. I'm opening I'm opening up a can tonight, bitch. Oh, I'm here for the shit tonight, bitch. I'm a walk I'm a waking it up. I'm waking this bitch up. Everybody, hold on. Stop the music. Stop the motherfucking press, bitch. Because I know y'all are seen on motherfucking Facebook, Miss Thing, and I know y'all are seen her comment, Miss Thing, bitch, okay? Welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, honey. The one, the only, that queen bitch herself, Miss Thing, Miss Amaya Legendary, R E V. L-O motherfucking N is live on the motherfucking airwaves with us. How you doing, sister? Ooh. Hey, what's going on? Baby, we here for the shit. What? I'm definitely here for the shit. Honey, we here for all of it, baby, honey. Hey, I'm, he I'm here hey. for it. So, we all, we all had an opportunity to sit and I, I sat in my room, Jason sat in his house, Marcus sat in his house, Amaya sat in her house, and we all had an opportunity to send each other lives all night Saturday, from one live going down to another live coming up, Miss Thing, watching the debauchery that went down in Chicago. Give me your opinions on what y'all seen. <laughs> Well, I don't think... Because I'm from the area I'm from, man. Y'all can go. <laughs> I 
Um, I, I guess I'll go first since, since mine is going to be brief. Um, it looks hot in there. Thank you. Okay. Okay. So, I think the ball was, um, it was hot, like, in, more, you know, multiple ways. Competition was there. The the spirits were up. Um, the people were definitely there. You know, it was just a few, ex- it was Thank just you, execution sir. things that I guess at a certain point it just grows out of your control. Some of the things that they probably could have foreseen or forecasted, and others maybe beyond their control. But um, I'm sure we'll talk about it. But I Kelly, I think debauchery is a, a, a bad word. Well, you know why I'm gonna say you know why I'm gonna say debauchery. You know why I'm gonna say debauchery, and I'm gonna say debauchery, and I'm gonna say allegedly. You know, I'm gonna use that word a lot tonight. Allegedly, the ball was supposed to be at Phipps Plaza, the legendary ballroom headquarters of Chicago from back in the days when they used to have the rag to riches ball and things. I heard it was advertised that the ball was supposed to be there. But allegedly, I heard that they never had a contract or an arrangement to have the ball there at all, Miss Thing. It was just a sham to get the girls to Chicago, allegedly. And I'm wow. just. <laughs> wow. Anyway, <laughs> I spoke to Ayana herself, and she acknowledged the fact that they made some major mistakes, and she felt, but she felt like overall the weekend was good. Um, I think, I just think that they underestimated what they could do. That's what I believe. I, I, I'm not going to say that it was, it was, it was like Monty said, it was good spirit. It was a lot of competition. The girls were definitely ready to walk. The girls definitely spoke. I miss you too, sir. Uh, I think the girls were unprepared. Let me tell you something, right? I sat and I watched the live. And girls kept saying on the live, bitch, this is all they kept saying. Oh, my God. It's so hot in here. Oh, my God. How am I at the ball and I got to watch the live to see the categories? Yeah. The girls was see, gagging. Ayana said that she, she, said that, she said the stage was, she said not having the stage was a mistake. But they were, I think that, I think that the stage wasn't used. They were trying to accommodate more people. But I think it actually backfired on them. Well, which, you know, for full disclosure, we tried to tell them that it didn't make it. Because we were on the poll, it was like, should we have a stage? And I'm like, okay, this thing saying, you know, 900 people are coming. So usually, right. you say, About okay, if they say 900, yeah. you, right, you say three fourths or half are going to come. So even at that, a stage was just necessary. Like, but it wasn't giving many ball teams, it was a major ball. But you right. know, I think right. live, you learn a lesson every year. Yeah, she said that herself. She's like, you know, she made some mistakes, certain things she wished she could have done better. But one thing I will say to, and I said this to them, so me saying it on the air is a problem. One thing I said to the other Chicago leaders is the fact that we can't complain if we don't help them. Everybody can have all the complaints they want to. They can say all the things that they did wrong. But if you don't have nobody helping in and pitching and trying to make it better, then then keep your motherfucking comments to yourself. Because the comments only come when, you, when you're willing to help. Well, 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 well. Let me tell you something, baby, okay? I'm so glad, and I'm going to be honest, I'm so glad I didn't, I'm so glad I didn't go, baby. And I don't know how the prodigies, shout out to the house of prodigy, but I don't know how they did it in that little small area that they was at, Miss Thing. It was no way that if the Miss Rahi's table was over there that I would have sat in that section, bitch, Okay? Bitch, that was like being that was like being in a motherfucking convenience store, bitch, with a man with a motherfucking loaded AK forty mother uh, uh, AK forty seven, bitch. Okay, bitch. It was only one way in and one way out of that section, bitch. Anybody could have came and shot up the section and all types of motherfucking shit, bitch. And you had nowhere to fucking go. It's like it was a mess. Hello to everybody that's saying hi to me. I love y'all all, honey. 
okay? It was a fucking, it was a mess, Miss Thing. I was gag, I was actually gagging at that motherfucker. It was a fool, Miss Thing, bitch. Because once you came in all the way from the back of the runway to the front of your table, you had to go back through all of that to get back out. No, okay? And then I heard that's why the uh it kept being so many pauses into in the ball people would say it it was so many pauses into the ball because the prodigies was not trying to go back that way to get back out and they was walking behind Vaughn and they was cutting off the microphone and stuff walking behind Vaughn to get out the section. That's why it was so many pauses and stops in between the ball. That was a fool. We gotta do better. We have to do, we have to, we have to do better. Yeah, I agree. I mean, I mean, I mean I, I'm not, I'm not going to sit up here and, and play political and be nice about this situation. If, if, if there was some fool shit going on, there's some fool shit going on. And a lot of things that happened was some fool shit. But at the end of the day, like you said, you live and you learn. But I also want to give a really big shout out to Demario Apology because he helped them out a lot. And, and I think that if he was not there, that the running of that ball on Saturday would have been even worse than what it was. Let me tell y'all something. There was a lot of there was a lot of fuckery going on. And and and, and also, once we get in deeper into this conversation, we're gonna talk about the judges. Because there was a lot of shade up there too. We got to stop putting all. We got to stop trying to put the dream team in the girls who are trying to give it to their girlfriends up there. But, saying, but Amaya, but Amaya, yeah. you know what, Amaya? And since you brought up, since you brought up the judges, Amaya, a lot of people have been requesting. A lot of people have been requesting for new judges, and you have went to certain balls where they have uh they have like okay you know you go to you i've been to a couple of balls when they say okay they're gonna put a rodney and a kelly up here with um with seven of a new girls up on the panel or they're gonna put a kelly and somebody else up here with seven new girls on the panel those new girls ain't doing nothing they're not doing nothing they're not chopping nobody, Miss Thang, bitch. They still giving it to their girlfriends, Miss Thang. And then they send it up here, Miss Thang. And then when you have the other people up there, the Rockneys, the Harrows, the Kellys, or the Tonys, or the Big James, and we're sitting on the end of the panel, and then you have these seven new girls in the middle, Miss Thang, they're looking at us. For acknowledgement to chop somebody or to do something, Miss Thang, or and they're not doing anything. But you you know you but you got you you know everybody keeps saying everybody keeps saying we want new girls on the panel. We want new girls on the panel. You can't have new girls on the panel, and I'm gonna tell you exactly why you can't have new girls on the panel, right? Because these new girls are scared to chop because they know that they still walk balls and they're gonna get retaliated against, Miss Thing. So you can't have those type of girls up there that still is active and walking balls and things because they're gonna get retaliated on when they come out and they walk because they shaded somebody. So they really hesitant to sit back and to chop people. So stop saying you want the new girls up here when the new girls ain't doing shit, Miss Thing, and they looking for acknowledgement from the older girls that's sitting up here with them, Miss Thing, about chopping somebody or doing something. No, bitch. If somebody asks you to come and judge, when nine times out of ten, most people will ask you to come and judge, bitch. You hit up their motherfucking phone and you ask them, can you judge they ball, Miss Thing, bitch? And they put you up there on the motherfucking panel. But then you get up there, Miss Thing, and you not doing what you were supposed to be up there fucking doing. Bitch, you just sitting there and you keep looking down at the end. Bitch, why are you looking down at the end, bitch? The contestant is in front of you, bitch. I ain't a contestant, so stop looking at me for acknowledgement. Yeah, that's true. <clears throat> that's definitely true. Bitch, because if I'm going to chop a bitch, I'm going to chop a bitch. I don't give a fuck who you are. Legend, icon, statement, star, no crookedy rickety, bitch. A bitch that was out before me, bitch. If I feel you ain't bringing it, bitch, I'm going to chop you, bitch. Yeah, I, I mean, you had that conversation. You know, I don't give a fuck. But I think a lot of people do. But then you got the girls that are all the old girls that, that is trying to let their old girlfriends do it because they know it ain't giving nothing anyway. So it's like a catch-22 when it com
It definitely was. It definitely was. It definitely, it definitely was. Let me tell you something, right? And we're gonna get, and we're gonna get, and we're gonna get into this. We're gonna get into this more in depth as the ball goes on, Miss Dang Bitch. But I'm tired of seeing. I'm tired of seeing bitches. I'm tired of to people to promoters that to promoters that is out there that is having a ball. In the winter time, I see the other caller that's on the phone line. You know who you are, the legend. I'm coming to you in a few minutes, but hold on. But I'm so tired of I'm so tired of promoters having a category that is called for winter white, and then you have icons and legends and fashion girls sitting up on a motherfucking panel, Miss Thing, and giving girls tens for winter white. And pearl and pure white, Miss Thing. I don't seen it twice in the last couple of months. They asked for winter white, Miss Thing, bitch, and they giving kids tens and giving away people money, and these kids are coming out in pure fucking white. Winter white is not pure white. But you got fashion girls sitting up on a panel, Miss Thing, giving girls tens and pure fucking white for winter white. And even, let's, let's be clear, even a $1,000 performance this on Saturday, congratulations to um, the person that won, because I think it was very well deserved. The bitch vote down, let's be clear, but the line was given very both him bad. It was not given a $1,000 look. It was not even from my own house or anybody else's house. Nobody in that line gave a $1,000 look. They barely gave a $1,000 performance. Let me tell you. And since you brung that up, yeah, I like a bitch that I can feed back off and go on, Miss Thing, bitch. Okay? And I'm glad the icon Terry is on here. Uh, and I hope other icons come up here and all types of things to this live and come up on the phone lines. Bitches in this category, Miss Thing. Another thing about promoters and these judges that been out for years are letting the girls do. Miss Thing, when a category says Vogan with a prop, you come and get your tens and you vogue the whole time with that prop. If the promoter, if the promoter or whoever's having the ball does not say that after you get your tens, you can put the prop down, the category is called Vogan with a prop. You continue to get your tens with the prop and you vogue with the battles with your prop. Bitches need to stop trying to change motherfucking ballroom. Okay? Bitch, I don't give a fuck if the category say Vogue it with a prop for a thousand dollars, Miss Thing. Bitch, you come out and you Vogue with the prop and you give a thousand dollar motherfucking performance, Miss Thing, bitch. I'm tired of bitches coming out, Miss Thing, bitch, and giving big lot motherfucking performance for a thousand dollars or for two thousand dollars and bitches are just giving them their tens and giving it to their girlfriend, Miss Thing. But then when you have a motherfucking ball, Miss Thing, you're sitting back here and you're reading the motherfucking judges for giving away your cash, bitch, but you did it at their motherfucking ball. Yeah, sure do. Like, how fucking dare y'all? You got the fucking nerve, and you got the fucking balls. <clears throat> okay? And all you bitches running around, let me tell you something, bitch. All you bitches running around, you hypocritical ass motherfucking faggots. Okay? You bitches keep running around, and every time motherfucking tick tick get in a fight, I see a motherfucking flood of justice for this person, ban tick tick this, and ban tick tick that. I ain't see one motherfucking post about banning Marquise X Ebony 007, Miss Thing, for fighting at the motherfucking ball, Miss Thing. Yeah, listen, I'm a cop, baby. Not one motherfucking post. I'm not, not a bitch said, not a bitch said a motherfucking thing. You old hypocritical ass motherfucking mooks. Not one post did anybody say ban him. Stop him from coming to balls. Not one. I'm not going to do that because I'm not going to do that because they don't fear because they don't they don't fear him like they fear a tick tick. And I'm not saying either one of them is right, but they that they they pay 
my case, and I, I've said this to people that are his friends, and, and, and cautionary tale, bitch, he is my brother, but his shit has to stop completely. And, and, and people coddle him, and they allow him to do anything that he wants to at a ball and say whatever he wants to, and they just say, oh, that's my keys, pay it. But at the end of the day, right and right, and wrong is wrong, and he wrong in a motherfucker for a lot of things he did this weekend. I, listen, let me tell y'all something, right? And I want to let y'all know because I'm jumping all over the place because I'm not staying. I'm not staying at one ball. We're not gonna do the Midwest. We're not gonna do the main ball and do the uh, aftermath and stuff. We're going all over the place. We all over the place, bitch, tonight. Okay. So I want to let I want to let all of, I want to let all of you girls I want to let all of you girls know that's in Chicago. Thanks to the legendary, and I'm about to, after I say my statement, I'm going to bring on the legendary directing mother, Marlon Mizrahi. After I say my statement, I'm going to bring Marlon on. Thanks to Marquise, the place where they had the ball at, the mini ball on Friday, and the place where they had the uh, aftermath yesterday. Thanks to Marquise, baby, I don't know what's going on in the Midwest, mistake, bitch. Y'all bitches in the, whip, in the Midwest like the snitch, mistake. I don't know what's going on, but thanks to motherfucking Marquise, Miss Thing, baby, y'all have lost another motherfucking venue in motherfucking Chicago, okay? Okay? Marquise had the nerve to call the cops and let the cops, and tell the cops that they, they was in the venue and they were serving underage children motherfucking alcohol and all types of things of that nature in the place. The lady got two fines and it's maybe losing her license, Miss Thing, thanks to Marquise, Miss Thing, for motherfucking calling the cops and bringing the cops in there. And then on top of him calling the cops and bringing the cops in there, baby, he read the dog shit out of Tayana and told her that she was sick, she was dying, and all types of things in front of the girls and everything, and in front of the cops and everything, Miss Thing. After knowing everything that this lady has been through, these are the things that you wish upon a lady that has been dealing with all types of different things since she had her bypass surgery. These are the things that you wish on someone. This nonsense needs to stop. It's fucking ridiculous. Hold on, I'm gonna bring I'm gonna take a commercial break. And I'm going to bring Marlon on after I take my commercial break. And these are words from my sponsor. Saturday, March 31st. Father Marcus and Mizrahi present Paper Fool's Ball. Saturday, March 31st. 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. Los Angeles, California. MC of the night. Legendary date show on Lanza. Categories include Grand Five. $1,000 for the all runway. $1,000 tag team performance. $1,000 2018 pieces only. Open to all streetwear in an exclusive 2018 sneaker. Mini grand prize. $500 best dress. $500 open to all realness. $500 realness with a twist. $250 open to all sex sirens. More categories on the way. The April Fool's Ball. Saturday, March 31st. 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. Los Angeles, California. Everybody, welcome to the everybody welcome to the show, the legendary Marlon Mizrahi. Marcus, darling. Marcus may have put us on hold. Uh, Thank you. Uh, Nothing. We just hear and we just discussing all the stuff that went down and that has been going on uh, this weekend. Like I'm so, and I want to, and I and I definitely do want to say. I am so glad that the girls came out in the way that the girls did come out this weekend to Chicago because it, has, it hasn't been a ball like that where the girls have came out and stormed like that in a long time. So I'm glad that, I'm glad that the girls actually came out like that. 
I wish that uh, the only thing that I wish was that they had an elevated stage. It was much cooler in there, and everybody that was there was able to walk the category that night. Because you know, you know, we uh, we tend to say, okay, we know we're gonna have an aftermath the next night. So if we don't get to all the categories, the girls will come the next night and they'll walk. But a lot of girls come in town and they come on Friday and they stay Saturday and they leave on Sunday and they not there for the aftermath and all of that stuff because a lot of girls got to go to work and things of that nature. So, you know, I just wish we'd get... I think balls... I really think balls need to go back. Balls need to start happening earlier. Because if you have a ball earlier, me and Marcus was talking about this earlier and Amaya, we was talking about this. If you start having balls earlier, baby, you'll get a chance that you'll uh, have an adequate venue that you'll be able to get to and the venue will stay open until 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. Venues don't want to stay open past that time. So if you start a ball early, you can get in and then go to the club after after party and all types of things. Stop trying. We need to stop trying to have these balls late at night. It's not working out. It's not. I think that um, they... Yeah. I mean, they, I mean, they tried, I think it was, everything was overwhelmed. I think that they didn't know exactly, um, how, you know, how many people were going to be in the building and how much competition was going on. But, I mean, I don't have no complaints about the ball. Like, I loved it. I loved everyone that was there. It was really nice. It was a lot of competition. It was very packed. Like, I ain't seen a pack like that in the Midwest since, like, 2011, I think it was, or whatever. And, um... I, I really, really, really enjoyed it. But they did start kind of early. They started before I even got there. Like, they started at, like, 11 o'clock at night. The ball started at 11 o'clock at night. But the reason why I said the ball should start early is because Number one, if you start a ball earlier, you open yourself up for a lot more better venues. Most people, most most reputable businesses are not going to want to stay open to 5, 6, 7 o'clock in the morning. So if you start a little bit earlier, you, you open yourself up to a wide array. So we read all these venues. We read them close to close, not just in Chicago. We read them from New York to California. And then but, but, but what we want to do is we want to be somewhere at 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 o'clock in the morning. That is, well, you can't have it both ways. 11 o'clock, if, if you start giving out awards at 11 o'clock, you know the girls is not going to get to the ball to 12, 1, almost 2 o'clock in the morning. So here it is, you got a function going on all night, but y'all complain about the venue. Yeah, um, so, so, so I mean, where I I have it's not 1999. I know, but what happens is, like, okay, because <laughs> I said the same thing, I was like, you know, the Midwest Awards ball, you know, just start, start probably like 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock. But then they said, you know, no, because people, that's kind of early. You know, some people don't get in from Friday night until 6 o'clock in the morning. So. Okay, well, then the girls need to stop going. The girls need to stop going. The girls need to, let me tell you something, right? You're going to get your fucking ass up. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Uh, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Right. Let me tell you something, and you know another thing. You know another thing I don't. You know another thing I don't like about a major ball, and I'm keeping and I'm keeping it funky with y'all. I don't. When it's a major ball, I hate for them to have a mini ball before the major ball. You know why? Because you have all the shade and stuff that carries over from the Friday night ball over into Saturday night, Miss Thing. All the chops and all the shade, bitch. All the retaliation and all of that stuff is gonna roll over into Saturday motherfucking night. Yeah, yeah, sometimes, but this, this particular incident, um, the mini ball was like really like, it was just really great experience. Everybody had a really, really good time. I don't even know if anybody got chopped. Like it was just, the, the mini ball was like really, really, really good. It was just, it was just a warm up. It was, you know, it was very, it was, I, I don't, this time, this particular time, I get what you're saying, but this particular time, I don't think it was like that. It was just everybody was 
really having a good time. Everybody was having a good time. Yeah, everybody, everybody did. Everybody did have a good time. I don't really think too much shade for Friday night ran over into Saturday night. It ran over to Saturday night. Marcus, Marcus, you're back. I don't really think too much shade ran over into Saturday night. But the girls need to learn how, bitch. If you talk about when you want the ball to start early, everybody want to get to their categories and stuff. The girls need to know how to party and not party like a rock star the night before, Miss Thing, so they can be able to get up and handle their business from when these balls start early, okay? Because, bitch, I remember back in the days when, I remember back in the days when balls used to start at 5, 6 o'clock in the morning, bitch, okay? You would leave from the motherfucking club, Miss Thing, at 4 o'clock in New York City. You would take your ass home, your shit shower and shave, Miss Thing, and get yourself together to go to the motherfucking ball after you left from the fucking club. And you ain't get out and you ain't get out the ball and you ain't get out the ball until motherfucking you ain't get out the ball until four or five o'clock in the evening. And it happened. Nowadays nowadays, for instance for myself, I'm excited to know that there's a party or whatever the day before. You know what I mean, before the ball. Because I don't just necessarily want to come just specifically for the ball. I still want to come any type of the time along with other people. So I do think that, you know, that is great promotion for somebody to have a party or whatever the night before. Yeah, but if the ball starts early, if the ball starts, listen, if the ball starts, if the ball starts about 5, 6 o'clock, okay, and you get out of that ball by 11, 12 o'clock, you still got time after the ball is over to go back to your room or wherever you need to go to, change your clothes, get together, and go to the party or go to the after party, and you can still party with the girls. I know, but I'm saying, like, nobody wants to be subjected to staying, coming down there. Some people don't want to just fly in town or catch the bus or ride or whatever the fuck they're doing to get there. Just to come to the ball on Saturday, like some people. But you, but but we gotta look at it. But we, and I'm gonna give you a prime example. And I keep telling, and I keep telling everybody this. I don't remember the child name. I don't remember the child name that came all the way from Chicago to the Ebony Ball, got on the bus the night before the Ebony Ball, got to New York in time for the ball. When the ball was over, he was leaving to get right back on the bus to go back to Chicago, and he only came for the ball and did not get a chance to uh, walk the ball. A lot of people do that. They come in town just for the ball and to walk their category and to go back home. I'm having a problem with a Friday night party. Because the Friday night party, the Friday night party, the Friday night party is a, a, a social life thing. I don't have a problem with the Friday night function. The problem is we're not going to keep Exactly, exactly. Cause I remember, I remember back. I re, and I'm gonna be honest with you, and I can, I can speak for myself. I remember back. I remember back in the days when I used to come, when I used to go to Atlanta, Miss Thing. I could not stand. I could not stand Atlanta, Miss Thing. And I'm keeping it funky with y'all. Over the years, I've grown to love Atlanta. But when I used to come to Atlanta, bitch, I would get on the first thing leaving Saturday morning to come to Atlanta, Miss Thing, bitch. When I would get dressed. For the motherfucking ball, get my hair, my makeup, and everything done. My suitcase was packed and it was open, and my sweatsuit was left on the fucking top of my motherfucking suitcase. When the ball was over, I would go back to the hotel, take off whatever I had on, bitch, put on my sweatsuit, close my suitcase up, and go right back to the airport and go back to New York. The girls would be calling my phone like, bitch, where you at? We doing this here on Sunday. Bitch, I'm already back in my motherfucking house. That's how some people like to be. And then to get and then to do all of that and come to the ball and your categories in the second half, and then you gotta spend money because they ask it for effect and not get a chance to walk your category. That's like a slap in the face. Like
Like some people, some people don't come for all the parties. Like, you know, I love the parties now. I love the parties. I love to come on Friday or Friday morning and go to the parties, go to the mini ball, bitch, and then go back to my room and sleep. You know, I don't sleep more than four hours. So, you know, I, I don't have a problem with all of that and doing that. But some people just, it's not that, it's not about that life. Some people can't afford to come someplace for a whole weekend and have a hotel room for a whole weekend and everything and not get to walk their categories. That's not fair. We have to do better as a community. We have to come together as a collective whole and make this better for everybody that comes and participates. And the reason I'm going to keep saying that is because I told y'all this once again. I know after 22 years of being in ballroom and going to walk the ebony ball and have to spend all the money that I spend to walk the ball and then not get a chance to, and I'm talking about spending cash, bitch. Not craft like I was doing for years, bitch. I know what people that work hard feels like to come to a ball, bitch, and not have a chance to walk and they don't spend their money for a fucking category. I know what that feels like now. So I feel for them. Bitch, and then, bitch, stop and stop having, and, and bitch, and stop having these fem queen face categories and all of these face categories all the way at the end of the fucking night at the fucking ball, Miss Thing. Bitch, these girls came out and they hiding in the car like old school mistake, coming in the ball, mistake, paying they $35 to walk a category, bitch, and then four or five categories later the fucking ball is over stop having these girls do that shit miss thing pick these fifth queen face categories in the beginning of the motherfucking ball and let these girls get their motherfucking life ballroom was made for fem queens not the fucking butch queens miss thing you got these bitches hiding out and fucking cars all fucking night long and then sometimes you bitches don't even get to their motherfucking category miss thing bitch or they gotta pay 30 or 35 dollars to get in bitch and only in there for three fucking categories and then they got a motherfucking leave bitch Gowns and makeup and dream teams and all types of shit cost a lot for us to come out and fucking walk. Why you think the girls don't come out and fucking walk? Hold on, Kelly, as promised, um, the, the ho one of the hosts of the Midwest Awards Ball is now on the line, the icon, Tayana Ebony. Hi, Tayana. Hey, hey, what's up? Category, I said because that's my category. 
then you got 30, y'all already know when you got thug words, y'all got 30 fucking thugs in line. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, mm -hmm. the ball so was more competitive. Right. right. Right, so the ball was just more competitive. Uh, competitive. So, it's not our fault on that, you know what I'm saying? Again, I apologize for the people that didn't walk, and I tried to make it up so I could check. You know how people be like, well, they closed the ball down because they got all this money in. No, I made it up. The next night, I made it free to a certain pass. Nominee. And when I hear you, Kelly. Nominee. Kelly. Jason. Huh? Uh, when I tell you, Kelly, it was 200 people in the building before I even got there. So it's said that I had to lie and said that I only got the building from 12 to 2, which I had extra time because we went to 3 o'clock. But I had to lie and post on Facebook that I got the building from 12 to 2, and the first people in from uh, 11 to 12 is free. It's, it's bad that you got to do that to get people in early. That's right, right. But I, I, you know, I got, like, like I told them, Tayana. I think uh, Ayana called me and she and she admitted the mistakes that was made and the things that happened. But like I told, you know, of course we said we we are girlfriends, you know what I'm saying, in Chicago on the side. And like I told them, at the end of the day, if we feel like that it was a problem at the ball and we feel like that it's things that can that can be fixed and changed, then then why won't we sit there and, and chuck our egos and help y'all make it better? We can't sit there and complain and read y'all yeah. not doing nothing to help. Right. I mean, the reads, they, they, I, I, I don't worry about the reads, obviously, I don't, when they read us, I mean, well, I'm not going to say us, and they read me on Facebook about certain things, I don't even go back and forth, you know what I'm saying, because I right. cannot appreciate you. I mean, and I'm going to address, I'm going to address that too, I'm going to address that too, Asia. I'm going to address that too, Asia. Um, and you know, and I think we need to, I think we need to, I, I really think it's no shame, Miss Thing, bitch. I think we need to stop LSS. Cause you have these bitches come out here and they wake the building up for motherfucking LSS bitch and they come back and walk their category bitch and they perform as this motherfucking lackluster for motherfucking uh for the uh for the category. Like these bitches come out bitch and they give you nasty 360 all types of flips, dips and spins and everything bitch for LSS bitch and then these bitches come back out for a thousand dollar performance bitch and it's like motherfucking Vogue and Vogue and one, two, three, big lock motherfucking performance. But let's, but let's be honest, most, most people in doing their categories be given lackluster nowadays. I don't, you can't blame it on LSS. You blame it on a bitch performance. Because if, if 20 minutes ago, or an hour ago, or two hours ago, you was able to wake the motherfucking building up, then two hours later, you should still be able to wake the motherfucking building up. That means you know what it is, though? They be holding it for their tens. They tried to, I mean, they holding it for the battle. And they, if they chop them, you won't get a chance to hold nothing for your, for your battle. LSS not gonna stop the girl. And, and if you stop LSS, you're still gonna have the girls giving blah 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 tens. You're still gonna have the girls giving watching grass grow because that's what the girls give because they be trying to save their little energy because they be on they, they be full and they be trying to save all the energy they can and battle a bitch. Right. And then they don't do shit. They don't do shit. They don't do shit when they motherfucking battle mistake, bitch. They don't do shit when they fucking battle at all mistake. And I ain't gonna name nobody. I ain't gonna name nobody motherfucking name. But bitches was on Facebook all motherfucking all Sunday reading, bitch, about bitches motherfucking and they performance and all types of shit. And I went back and I watched the lives mistake, multiple different lives, and I'm looking at like. What the fuck are y'all reading for, mistake? Because this person won over that person, mistake. Because both of their performances look like shit. The girls be scared to judge. Let's be clear. If they do the day was coming onto a stern judge's panel, they, the girls will pull their performance together. The girls know when they can get through on bullshit and when they have to really work for it. The girls know it. The girls not dumb. The girls are not dumb. But eliminate, I mean, I don't care if you eliminate LSS or not, but to eliminate it is not going to make the category even more hotter. Because the girls are still going to give blah, blah, blah. The girls know that they can rest on their morals. The girls can rest on the fact that their girlfriends are there. The girls got a lot of things to rest their hat on, so the girls not going to put forth the effort. Period. Well, girl, listen, let me tell you something. Tayana. Go ahead, go back to Tayana. I just had to say that because they put that in the comments. Tayana. Tayana. But so you thank everyone for coming. Um, 
you know, it was nice. Are there any other things that you want to, you know, say to the people or besides that? And then we can go into some questions. Um. And I really, I mean, I, again, you know, the recess of the night. And I, I also saw you guys, the uh, comment about, you know, the Marquis situation, of the people that know what happened, you know what I'm saying? Um, I just think that was really major, you know, the $2,000 fine. Um, you know, I think it was a $2,000 fine. And um, brought the police in there and told them that I was very, uh, I'm the age kid's liquor, and um, I didn't have a party permit because he felt like I didn't pay a person that I didn't ask. To, well, I asked to come and say, um, we made this arrangement about a month or two ago. However, she really did, or I didn't make the arrangement because I was down. I actually had surgery, but after she sent me the text, it, it was made. And, um, well, I'm going to just say the name. Y'all know I ain't, I don't care. Precious uh, was there uh, to commentate, and um, he got there late. Again, this is the aftermath, and I told people that we're going to be out of there at two, so I wanted to stop early. So and let me and let oh, Tiana, let me stop you, okay? And it's no shade, and it's no shade to none of the motherfucking commentators, Miss Thing. Whether a bitch is gonna start, and whether a bitch is gonna start their ball on time or not, Miss Thing, bitch, okay? If you are paid, if you are being paid to be there, and they ask you to be there at that time, that you should be there at that time. Whether you gotta sit around and you gotta wait until the girls get in the building to start, if they ask you to be there at that time, you need to be there at that motherfucking time, Miss Day. Bitch, it's no shame, Miss Thing. I love all the girls, and all the girls is cut, Miss Thing. But a lot of these motherfucking new commentators, Miss Thing, bitch, it's no shame. They're feeling they motherfucking pussy, Miss Thing, bitch, like they are Selvin, or Jack, or Eric, Miss Thing, and they're not. Let me say something. Let me say something about commentators. You are staff. You are not a wall participant. You are not a here to enjoy yourself. You are not here to uh, to socialize. You are the paid staff. You just like the security at the front door. You just like the bitch that serve and drink at the ball. And you just like any other person that is working at a ball. You're being paid to be there. So you just, just like when you go to work in the real world, you don't just show up when you want to because you're feeling bad. Bitch, you show up on time or you don't get paid. Yeah. It's no shame, Miss Thing, bitch. These venues, these venues, and these catering people that y'all have, that y'all having at these balls and things, Miss Thing, bitch, they got y'all under contract, Miss Thing. It's no shame. I think it's time to put the girls underneath motherfucking contracts. Back to Tayana. <laughs> I asked, uh, it was asked, um, uh, as a commentator. First, we got the second half. We got the second half of all with all of them. So, I don't feel like if I, I feel like if I, I have to go to the file and I really appreciate the, uh, he's a blind What is his name? Jalon, Jelani, or Jalon. Jalon, Jalon. Because if it wasn't for him, I would have been. I met the ball that wasn't You know what I'm saying? Waiting on the ground for him. That's what he did. the ball. I did. He did like two or three people at us as he called the judges. And the ball went on. We just with that. Even though, you know, Marquis is still interrupting the ball as usual. You know what I'm saying? And I keep telling Marquis I'm going to put you well. But again, I looked at Marquis as being a brother. You know what I'm saying? And you. Y'all the ones that really fuck over you. Javion, sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Javion. <laughs> and to all the people, if you're on the phone lines and you want to talk, feel free to definitely press one and we'll definitely bring you on. I see that we have a couple of callers. Give me a few seconds and we're definitely going to bring you on. So, uh, okay, let me, um, I'm long story short, first and foremost, I just said it. You text me. It was like, I thought I was going to do a certain category. I never had that picture. Whenever she went there, she grabbed the microphone, and she started commentating. And at the end of the night, it was for, you know, her trailer. And I'm like, okay, well, I just paid this other guy. You know what I'm saying? Why should I 
He was missing three seats out of his eight seats that was for his table. We only needed four. For the four members that we had. I'm not I'm not gonna do this, but the thing So you got anything else you want to say, Carla? Uh-uh. 
Okay, thank you. Press 1 to take your hand down, please. The next caller we have is a private caller. Private caller, you're live on the air. Are you here for the shit, or are you just here? Tread lightly. Well, that, that remains to be seen. Really good evening. This is Ty Balmain from Captain's Live. I have a question for Tiana. Hi, right, Kai. Go ahead. She's right there. So, Tiana, I, I saw a part of the, because uh, I actually didn't get a chance to see anything, but I saw a, the end of the ball I saw live where you appear to be on the microphone explaining um, that you didn't vote for a certain status that was that was pronounced and you you know it, it takes voting in the midwest for ledgers and icons and, and so forth and so on so to me it seems like you were in agreement with the status so my question is how did the person wind up with the mic to make that announcement if that's not something that you agreed to Okay, hold on, Kai, before she okay. be, hold on, Kai, before she answer that, because we didn't even get to the status part. Before she answer that, let me start my shit, Miss Thing, okay? And then we're gonna get back to Tayana, right? Okay? So let me start my shit, okay? okay? You know, okay. So this is what happened, okay, right? So do y'all remember last month, right before the Detroit Awards Ball, Miss Thing, I dropped the motherfucking list, Miss Thing, bitch, of all the girls that was supposed to be getting deemed at the Detroit motherfucking Awards Ball, Miss Thing, okay? So the girls were supposed to be getting deemed at the Detroit Awards Ball, and then that fat whale, Miss Thing, that had the ball, Miss Thing, and the only reason I'm disrespecting him, Miss Thing, bitch, is because he disrespected Disrespected me, Miss Thing, bitch, when he went and he made his motherfucking post. So that's why I'm disrespecting him now. Okay, that fat whale, Miss Thing, that was having the ball, didn't know that the girls was deeming all of these legends and these icons at his ball, Miss Thing, underneath his motherfucking nose, Miss Thing. So once I dropped the motherfucking T, Miss Thing, bitch, he gave the very, oh no, this shit was not going to happen, Miss Thing. So the girls already knew that the girls in Chicago was getting deemed this weekend, Miss Thing, bitch, okay? So the girls gave the very, okay, so we're gonna go and we're gonna crack some new plaques, Miss Thing, with the new motherfucking date for the Chicago Awards Ball, Miss Thing, and after they deem the people, Miss Thing, that they voted for in the committee, we're gonna come out, Miss Thing, and we're gonna storm the runway, Miss Thing, and we're gonna deem the girls that we were supposed to deem in Detroit, we're gonna deem them here in Chicago. So that's how all the girls got deemed, and that's how Marquise was up there on the mic deeming the girls. Tayana, go ahead. Oh, I'm here for the shit. Y'all gotta, y'all gotta be, y'all gotta be with her. Y'all know my sister just came home from the hospital, so she can't speak that loud. So y'all gotta listen closely. I'm sorry. Um, um, Andre and I, I just want to let them know, like when we do stuff like that, we, you know, we all communicate with each other. So it was like just everything else was like BS stuff. So I don't know what they're doing. I don't want. I, this just is what I don't want to from a situation when I do make comments for me. Oh, you feel like you're the only one to make what to make decisions like that. But that's not true. That's not true. I go to a whole board. Hold, hold, hold on. 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 Hold
to the Midwest and actually, you know, know what the girls do and see the girls on the floor. So all these other girls that got seen that y'all already know that was a fool, is a fool. I'm going to just leave it at that. <laughs> so, Tyana, do you, are you prepared to list the seven people who were approved, who you were aware of? Yeah. Um, yeah, I posted up. No, can you tell us over the phone? Um, I, um, again, it was, I have it in my heart. Tayana, 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 Tayana. Tayana, uh, because you're on a three-way call, they cannot really hear you, so I'm calling you from the switchboard right now, so answer your phone. So they can hear, so they can hear you louder. I'm calling you right now from the switchboard. Answer your phone so the girls can hear you clearly. And hang up on the other line. Hello? Yeah, okay. So they can hear you clearly. Clearly. Now, Marcus, you hang up on her on the other line, Marcus, so they can hear her clearly because they're saying they can't hear her. Go ahead, Tayana. Well, Tayana, click me out. <laughs> I speak to you all. Okay, okay, go ahead. Now they can hear you clearer. Okay. However, there has been my email, so I'm watching my email now. Tell you I'm a Let me ask you a question, Tayana. It's, it's is the list that Tommy posted up, is that with the people that, that you were in agreement with? The computerized list? Um, with the icons and the legends on there? And it was, this one, this, this, this particular list, I can tell you this, this particular list had legends on there, and I think it had one icon, let me see. Can I say again, it did a bit, I know for sure the icons, because I think it was only five. It was Jamie, it was Sebastian. Okay, go ahead. It was Jamie for Icon, Sebastian for Icon, um, Tati, um, Rodell, um, I mean, no, Tati was, uh, legendary, I'm sorry. Um, no, that's legendary. If I hear that, Tati, um, Ariana got on, Aja no, that's, that's legendary. Yeah, that's okay, but this is the list. Same apology. Sarah Chanel, I can't see this other name right now. Um, O.C., no, 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 Dre Prodigy, Monica Khan, T.J. Ebony, Mike Mike Chanel, Little Big Prodigy, I can't see that name. Well, that's more than that's Yeah, that's no, but this is a computer and it's where they were voting. At the end of the night, I, I heard it was an award day. I mean, 14 awards. At the end of the night, I heard that it was 14 awards came out, and that was that was not uh, supposed to be at all. No, oh, it was more than 14. It was actually it was actually 20. See, and well, I'm just letting you know it was seven. It was seven plaques originally after we did our vote, and then it was um five um it was five icons on that. Four or five icons. Oh, so seven, seven legends and five icons? No, just, um, yeah, seven legends and five icons. So that's 12. And this, this is the first time that, you know, they ever deemed icons edible, you know. They just feel like the Midwest really don't have that. Okay. The icons that's here, they feel like, okay, the only icons that's here in the Midwest is in Chicago. So they want the other icons like, well, to the point everybody everybody house like okay um i need uh now y'all they don't deem these icons over here so now bitches gotta deem icons over here now bitches gotta deem icons over here now bitches gotta deem legends over here everybody is not gonna everybody is not gonna sit at the big table miss thing 
Bitch, girls need to start learning that mistake. Everybody is not going to sit at the big table. Some bitches are going to stay in the chitlin' motherfucking circuits, Miss Thing, bitch. Everybody needs to learn it. Everybody is not going to the motherfucking White House, Miss Thing. Some of you bitches got to stay in the governor's mansion, Miss Thing, bitch. And that's just how it is, Miss Thing. But everybody seems like it's just a competition. Okay, so now they got icons in their house. Now we got to get some more icons in our house. Now we got to get some more legends in our house. Like, what the fuck? Everybody, where it's just like, and I keep, and I've been saying this for years. It's like the music, it's like the music industry. Everybody is not going platinum. Some people going to go platinum. Some people going to go double platinum. And some people going to go triple platinum. Everybody ain't going platinum, bitch. Some bitches got to stay at gold, bitch, and stay at bronze, bitch. It's, it's a it's a fight 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 for nothing this thing because at the end of the day bitch you can't go and you can't go and, i can't go at the end of the day i'm gonna use myself for example at the end of the day bitch i can't go down to a motherfucking job interview a bitch and tell them i'm the icon jess kelly from the ballroom scene miss thing bitch and i'm fab miss thing bitch i got i got uh i got 30 i got thirty thousand followers on my motherfucking page and i need to get hired at this job miss thing no i can't this thing like what and then you got and then you got some girls and then you got some girls that have the gall and the audacity miss thing because they got deemed icon or legend miss thing and the commentators don't know that they got deemed icon or legend miss thing like oh bitch i'm not coming out because they ain't call me icon or they ain't call me legend bitch you lucky you got the motherfucking shit right <laughs> Terry, I'm not Terry, I'm not reading Terry, I'm not reading I'm not reading nobody's status or throwing shade at nobody's status. I'm not that girl, Miss Thing, to read nobody's status, bitch. Cause they read minds all the time, Miss Thing, bitch. And it's been over two years, Miss Thing, and they still reading it, bitch. So I don't read nobody's status. They can give it to everybody. I'm just saying in general, bitch. Okay? I don't give I ain't gotta fight. I ain't gotta fight in it, bitch. I don't wanna sit on no motherfucking conference. Don't call me. And ask me about my vote on deeming somebody legend or anything. Don't call me, bitch. Call Andre and Jack for that. Don't call me, bitch. Because I, I ain't got time for it, bitch. Because if it's up to me, bitch, I'm voting for everybody, bitch. Because they don't see mine, bitch. I'm voting for everybody, bitch. So don't call me. Don't ask me shit. Only ask me to judge. Everybody felt like when you made the speech that you, that basically I think what the confusion was that you making the speeches that people felt like you didn't see the statuses. I think that's what it was. Yeah, like, no, I'll pass you that mic. You know what I'm saying? No. 
But, you know, I, I, I don't know how it went. You know, Ayana was, I'm not going to blame Ayana because it was just a lot going on on her. But, you know, she should have had better control of that. She know the way that we do that, and that was totally out of the ordinary the way that it happened. Well, July, well, July 14th, July 14th, I have two plaques that I'm issuing out on July 14th, Miss Thing, and I'm deeming my two girls July 14th, Miss Thing, bitch. I have control of that, Miss Thing, girl, and so on July 14th, I will be deeming two more radio legends, Miss Thing, for deny, for annihilating radio and fucking radio up as how they have fucked radio up like no other on July 14th. I have the power for that, bitch. And so I have two more legends that I'm deeming July 14th. Oh, I'm here for the shit. Um, um, let me just cut in right there because it's going to be a fight at Marcus Ball if you do this. What? Then it's going to be me and you. I got two more radio legends, mistake. Girl, you don't have your legendary yeah, status. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do not say that it will not be no fight at my ball. You will be sitting in Mecklenburg County Jail. I spent seven months for this place. You going to jail, Kelly going to jail. I'm not playing. I'm not fighting him, Miss Thing. Know. She don't, Jason don't have. Jason don't have his status for two years, Miss Thing girl. And I got two more radio legends oh, that I'm demon. Miss Thing, Miss Thing, how are you going to do that? But you, how are you going to give two new people a plaque and I don't have one? Oh, Miss Thing, girl, you know, you was like me, Miss Thing. We ain't getting no plaque. We just got our status, Miss Thing, girl. Kelly, <laughs> can I ask you something? One more question. Go ahead. Thank you. So, Tyana, having said what you just said, how are you guys going to um, handle the situation um, regarding is, it, is the deeming valid or not? For the ones that was voted on, of course, those are valid. But how are you going to handle the other situation? Because otherwise, it's going to be, like, confusing to people when they travel. If we don't know if it's legit or if it's, you know what I mean? Are you guys going to be talking about that out in the Midwest or what? Well, this, this is the thing right here. Um, I, I, I don't know how you guys do it. But we look at it, so this, is, this is how I would see it. I mean... And I had, this, this happens before, even to one of my girlfriends, and I hate to throw his name out here, Puda, for example. Puda, um, Ms. Rahi, I mean, Herrera, uh, he had me in residence. And, you know, um, people didn't see it because it wasn't done the right way. They, they feel like that it wasn't done the right way. So, Toya, uh, you know, about my Toya, congratulations, bro. Um, what she did was, she, she, uh, she was sure that it was right, so he just stopped him every time he walked. I live in every category. Okay. I mean, well, it was, it, wait, wait, it was done another time, so another one of my, I, I, and I'm using my, my people, for example. So, um, Balenciaga, um, Walked in the land, uh, in the land uh, a legendary category, and Fred didn't see his legendary status, and Fred stopped him. So, I mean, it's well, I, mean, I know, I know that happens a lot. I've seen it happen, God knows how many times. But I was yes, just I mean, wondering. Again, come, oh, another one of my girlfriends, Camaro, for an example. You know what I'm saying? So, it, it, it's up to it's up to y'all. If y'all see it, y'all see it. If y'all know it's not right. I mean, they can't. But well, what about those to... ones that they'll never get to walk the category? It's not, it's not a category. So do they get the rights and privileges obtaining there too? <laughs> what category? Though? I mean, I no, I mean they get an LSS or you know. Okay, okay, because she's all being political. So girl, and she my girlfriend, so I'll say it because she, it's not coming from a shady place. So I'll say because I don't all this political bullshit, girl. We gonna cut that bullshit short. Okay, girl, y'all deemed that y'all y'all allow a girl to be deemed for legendary leadership. Do you well, what do you what do you do when you're a legendary leader? Well, she ain't the only one. I mean, I mean, if you're a legend, let, let's let's just keep it going. You're a legendary leader. It's not like you're a legendary for a category. 
So I, 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 I felt coming up that you can only walk. That's, that, yeah, that's just like drag, drag. I'm going to say drag performance. You're necessary for drag performance. There's no one in hell that I, okay, you made your transition, that you're able to walk uh, 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 you're like, right. you know, you're drag. You were a drag queen. Now you have to make your mark as a film queen. I don't know. Everybody on the live is asking. I don't know what is a demon of legendary leadership. I don't know. I don't know what that is. It's a new. It's a new. It's a. It's a new. Now let's let's be for real. Now y'all know there are a lot of people in the scene that are legends for being legendary. They're not legendary for a category. Now y'all stop playing. Y'all better stop mistake because if y'all start your shit mistake, girl, I'm gonna start mistake. Okay, because you got legendary, you got legendary, you got legendary leadership mistake, and you got icon leaderships too. <laughs> Let's not just say it's in the Midwest, trust me, it's a lot out there that these folks. It's a lot, but you know, but it, it, to me, that, I ain't going to say that's where it started, but I, you did, for them to just be honing in on this person, um, well, I you know. I'm going to say it in general because that was the conversation. You know, so are y'all bitches here, are y'all here for the shit, are y'all here for the shit, mistake, or are y'all just here, mistake? I don't know now about to play with me. Mistake, cause y'all sitting here, y'all sitting here, and y'all playing around like this is the first time y'all done heard this mistake, bitch. And y'all already know they got icon leadership mistake, bitch. They got legendary leadership mistake, girl. So stop playing around like y'all never heard this before, mistake. Because, bitch, if y'all want me, see, I'm not trying to get here. I'm not trying to be. I'm, I'm here for the shit mistake, but I'm not trying to be here for the shit mistake. Because, bitch, if I get here for the shit mistake, then the girls gonna start throwing them subliminals and all types of shit mistake, and then I'm gonna have to clap at these bitches at mistake. And when I clap, bitch, I don't give a fuck mistake what I say mistake when I clap at a bitch. Cause reading is reading, bitch. All read is violent, bitch. When I read. No, I'm not talking about you, sister. I'm talking about if I start dropping names. So let me ask you, wait, wait, wait. So let me ask this question. They got the, okay, you got legendary, legend, you have now legendary leadership. Do you honestly think these people that have received this acknowledgement are actually going to come out and walk a ball under that. So if they're just getting deemed for legendary leaders, you were you've been in Baltimore for this amount of time, you haven't really done nothing on the floor, but we're gonna make you a legend for leadership. What is the if they're not gonna they not about to get out on no floor, how you already got legendary icons that don't get out on the floor now that are that with these social social titles. So if someone gets deemed for leadership or they get deemed for participation and ballroom because they've been in there 50 fucking years and they never really done nothing, they never really made a mark, what is the problem? I don't understand the question. It's okay, for that one person that just got deemed for leadership, I don't see her getting out on nobody's floor and then walking on legendary category. You know what, Miss Sang? The next time, the next time a bitch have, the next time a bitch have a ball, they should have leadership, a leadership category. You gotta show them why you a great leader. A legendary toilet cleaner, a legendary wheelchair pusher, 
a legendary bag holder mistake, bitch. Let's just start deeming all the girls mistake, girl. We got a lot of, we got a, we got a, wait, hold on, hold on, Jason. We hold on, Jason, because we got a lot of, we got, wait, hold on, because we got a lot of girls mistake, bitch, that uh, been around girls for years mistake, girl, and they've been a legendary bag holders mistake and legendary uh cheerleaders mistake. So let's start deeming them too, mistake. Jason Prodigy mistake, bitch. We need to start deeming these bitches mistake for their legendary Brad Breath mistake. These bitches for their legendary sweat pockets that they have on their arms and their back mistake. They legendary fucking crooked motherfucking teeth they got mistake. Just start deeming the bitches for all of their shit mistake, bitch. Everybody can be legend mistake. You can be a legend. You can be a legend. You can be an icon. You can be an icon mistake. Let's deem everybody mistake, bitch. Because it's a lot of motherfucking shit that bitches can be deemed for mistake. You can be deemed for coming to a ball and being funky as motherfucker. Motherfucking shit for years, mistake, bitch. Let's start deeming those bitches too. It is watered down, Demarcus. I agree to you. It's watered down, and it's a lot of confusion. And people, I, I'm just saying things that people are saying in private. When people call my phone and they being cute, I'm just saying it out loud. I don't have a problem with anybody having status. They said, bitch, they got status on Saturday night. And I don't see her in no way, shape, form, or fashion. But I still, I still invite her and congratulate her because, bitch, at the end of the day, if they gave it to you, bitch, congratulations. Hold on, hold on, y'all, hold on, y'all. Give me, give me, give me a second. Give me a second. Give me a second. We gotta pay some bills, baby, and we're gonna be right back. And we got like seven callers, so hold on. Let me pay some bills, and we're gonna be right, right back. mistake, bitch, and I played the commercial mistake, and everybody took their motherfucking hands down. Cause you should have went straight to them, okay? Mistake, yeah. I had to pay some bills first. Oh, well, you could have paid the bills in a second. Honey, they all took their hand down. It was all of these numbers up in that. But if y'all want to talk, press one. We here for the shit. Bitch, don't be afraid, mistake. Y'all bitches need to start using y'all voice, mistake, girl, okay? Every, and I, and I, and I, and I try to, and I say this all the time when I do a live, when I do a live, this thing, okay? And when um, I'm on the radio, y'all have to use your voice 
Your voice is very powerful, okay? Stop thinking that if you stand up and you use your voice that somebody is going to retaliate against you and think. Your voices are valuable. Use your voices. Stop stop sitting in the motherfucking... Stop sitting in the comment section. Stop sitting in the bleachers. Stop sitting in the pill pits. Baby, use your voice and speak up. The only way you're going to get changed and change is going to come if you use your voice. Y'all got to use your voice. Come on now. Like, damn. We got a caller, 559-3. Five, 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 how, how can they use their voice if they're house leaders and overalls are telling them they will get put out if they call into the show? Well, I don't know. I don't know. Five, I don't know. 553-347. Five, five, three, three, You're live on the air. Are you here for the shit or are you just here? So, Kelly. Yes. Um. I got a, um, I got a question. So, hey, Jason, hey, um, hey, Naima. 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 Hey,
girl, they don't have that. They don't want to elevate to the next, they don't want to elevate to the next level. Miss Thing, because even with the realness, even with the realness with the twist category, realness with the twist was a thug boy that would sit around and act like he knew how to vogue, Miss Thing, and he wasn't landing his dips. He wasn't landing his spins and all types of stuff like that. It was wacky. It was crazy. And then you'll gag like, oh my God, this thug ass nigga is out here doing this. And it was like a joke and you would laugh at shit like that, Miss Thing. Now it's like, bitch, oh, you watching a performance category again. Nobody's elevated to the next level when it comes to these categories. Exactly, that's what it was. It was like it was the category has evolved, just like back in the day. Sim Queen Face really was Sim Queen Face of back day is not Sim Queen Face of today with the advancements of surgery. Y'all need to stop comparing those. No, no, wait a minute. Let me tell you something, Marcus. Okay, I feel like certain categories. Okay, you can evolve, 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 but I feel like certain ones. It's like because let me tell you something. It'd be enough with the between the sisters versus twisters, or just the between both them. It'd be enough with that lineup. But then you, then you got real with a twist. It's like a whole nother to me, and this is my opinion. I don't know. I don't know, book. I don't know why. I don't know why. It's, I don't know why. It's like, I don't know why it's like that. I don't know why it's like that, boogie. I really don't know why it's like that. And I wish that. And I wish that. I wish that they will go back to act, actually the category being realness with a twist. A lot of these motherfuckers would. A lot of these motherfuckers wouldn't be walking if they had to come out and get their tens for realness first. Cause a lot of these motherfuckers ain't real. Uh, a lot of times they do, Kelly, and y'all still get them tens. They do. It's it's a few that don't, but y'all still give them tens. So let's not go there. Mm. I say running for the twist. If you want, if you want to really play with it, I think it needs to be very five for your realness and ten for your uh, for your twist. And I feel like they should change it up. It shouldn't be always expected for them to go. Like, you, like, bag out or something. If you run with it, like, get it, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you want to play with it, play with it outside of just another fucking vogue fan category. Because that'd be getting well, out of like, okay, You know, I want to, I want to get, I want to get off of this ball for a minute. Marlon, are you still there on the phone line, Marlon? Marlon, yes. you still there? Cause they said Marquise Marlon Marlon, they said Marquise whooped your ass on Saturday at the ball. Sure. That's the tea that came through my desk. They said she whooped your ass at the ball, Miss Thing, on Saturday. So what's the tea? Cause I see your post. Oh, listen. Oh. I want to know what happened, Miss Thing. How did y'all get into How did y'all get into another fight, Miss Thing? Girl, because that bitch is mad and evil. She be so upset. She be so upset. She's delusional. She has a mental problem. Well, she lied and told other people that I said that if I was on the panel, I came up to her and said, "Bitch, if I was on the panel, I was gonna chop. I would have chopped you." And some weird bitch out. Well, Miss Say, she did look a hot mess to me, Miss Say, girl. Honey, I ain't know what she had on, Miss Say, girl. I'm just saying. Eddie, you know, they said give it. She needs to be banned. They said give it to your girlfriend, honey. Annoying. Mm. Honey. Oh my shit, oh my god, what was the chant that they said that they made up? They said that they made a chant up, Miss Thing, uh, for the prodigies this weekend, Miss Thing, at the ball. Miss Thing, they said they remixed, they said they remixed the Miss Rahi chant for the prodigies this weekend. Oh, they said, um, get over it. Oh, yes, honey, bitch, honey. 
They said the prodigy was like, get over, I mean, uh, give it to your girlfriend. And the girls was like, get over it, bitch. Get over it, bitch. They said, give it to your girlfriend. Mistake. That's what they, they said the prodigy was like, give it to your girlfriend's mistake, bitch. And the motherfucking, the girls was like, get over it, bitch. Get over it, bitch. Honey, oh, the girls were chilling in, honey. Baby, hey, Roxanne. Roxanne here for the shit. Yeah, Sonny. But you know, we gotta we gotta do better. We really we got we really we really gotta do better when it comes to balls. One thing I could say, one thing I could tell one thing I can tell y'all, July fourteenth, Miss Thing, and not because this is my girlfriend, Miss Thing, bitch. One thing I can say, Miss Thing, because I be reading this bitch down, Miss Thing, bitch. And it seems like it's always like this, Miss Thing, every time I go to Charlotte, North Carolina, Miss Thing. Bitch, you know how you leave your hotel room, Miss Thing, bitch, and you go to the ball, Miss Thing, and when you get to the fucking ball, bitch, you guys are like, okay, I'm going to run into the bathroom, Miss Thing, bitch, I'm going to get myself together, Miss Thing, you know, and go around and I'm going to mingle with a girl. It never motherfucking fails, bitch, when I get to fucking Charlotte, North Carolina, Miss Thing. I get out the car, Miss Thing, I give them my name at the motherfucking door, Miss Thing, bitch, and they calling me to the motherfucking judges panel, Miss Thing, bitch. It's fucking 6 fucking 30, Miss Thing. A bitch that ain't even getting a chance to go to the bathroom to make sure her tuck's still in place, Miss Thing, to make sure her makeup is still right, make sure she got no make uh no lipstick on her teeth or nothing, bitch. Kelly bitch right to the judges panel. Damn boss bitch, why you gotta always start on time? Because you know how much extra I will cost? Okay. Bitch. So bitch, yeah, best to believe, bitch, they started on time. First of all, I wanna c I don't know, I don't remember everybody that won. But what I can say is from this weekend, I want to congratulate the um, House of Ninja. I want to congratulate the House of Ninja because the first couple of categories at the Chicago Awards Ball, it was like Grand Prize Ninja, Grand Prize Ninja. I want to congratulate uh, the Prodigy Girl for the $1,000 win um, this weekend uh, in North, and I mean in uh, Chicago for Femme Queen Realness. I want to congratulate the Prodigy uh, Vogue Femme. Hello, 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 hello. Junie Prodigy from North Carolina. Excuse me, I don't know their name. Sorry, baby. Junie Prodigy from North Carolina. Congratulations on her win. What's the boy name from North Carolina, Marcus? His name is Jatari, but he lives in Atlanta now. Okay, Jatari Prodigy, Jatari Prodigy for the thousand dollar win. I want to congratulate him on the thousand dollar win. Um, I want to congratulate. Let me see who else I remember that won something. I don't know who won legendary performance, but congratulations to them. Congratulations. Uh, congratulations. I think. It, okay. Um, I think, uh, uh, congratulations to the boy that won phase, TJ Ebony. I think, yeah, TJ Ebony won phase. Congratulations. TJ Chanel. Oh, excuse me, TJ, TJ, TJ Chanel, sorry, TJ Chanel. Uh, congratulations to him for winning phase. I remember that. Um, let me see what else I remember that I can congratulate somebody on this thing. I didn't get a chance. I didn't watch the performance category. I didn't watch the legendary performance category. But uh, the way the girls was talking, I got I got to go back and I got to find a lot to watch it. They said motherfucking, they said motherfucking Tiffany came out, Miss Thing, and she gave you old school motherfucking Tiffany motherfucking prodigy from back in the days when Han Shadira used to storm. So congratulations, Tiffany, for coming out and fucking the building up and letting the girls know just because I got hips, I got ass, I got tits, I got body, I got face now, Miss Thing, girl. I can motherfucking fuck it up, Miss Thing. I can still fuck it up. Congratulations to Chief. She prodigy for uh drag's performance. Um uh Miss Thing bitch. It was a lot of bitches. A lot of people came out and definitely fucked the building up this weekend. But bitch, the prodigies came to Chicago, bitch, and they let the girls know, bitch, I'm here for the motherfucking shit, Miss Thing. And they stormed a lot of categories and walked away with a lot of motherfucking cash. So congratulations to the House of Prodigy. Congratulations to Man, Miss Thing, and everything that he has done, Miss Thing, with the House of Prodigy and, and Jason as well, and all the leaders over there in the House of Motherfucking Prodigy. Uh, for Sunday night, Miss Thing, congratulations to Victoria Prodigy, Miss Thing. It was great to see her back up on the motherfucking floor, Miss Thing. And she slayed the girls for motherfucking realness on motherfucking, uh, 
uh, on uh, Sunday, Miss Thing. I really didn't watch a lot of the ball on Sunday. The only person I know from Sunday that won was Victoria, because that's the only thing that I um I really uh I really watched, and then I fell asleep, Miss Thing. I wasn't really paying too much attention. I was watching Housewives and all my different shows, but I really didn't pay attention. So the only person I know from Sunday night that won was Victoria, and she looked the motherfucking good, and her leather pants, and her leather bustier, and her black and white jacket with her heels on, and her hair snatched back in a ponytail, was sitting this thing, now she's the only person I know from Sunday night, so, please, I'm just saying, honey, and congratulations, congratulations to all the girls, congratulations to all the girls that has, um, got their, uh, legendary status, and the icon status and everything i hope that now that you have your status and things of that nature that you're going to do something with your status and that, and not just sit back on uh your laurels and your uh, and shit like that and say oh i'm a legend now and stuff like that but congratulations to y'all i hope y'all keep uh scribing to move on and to become better and elevate yourself and if a lot of girls out there don't see your status miss thing only thing you got to do is just keep bringing it and make them see your motherfucking status like that, Miss Thing, honey. Congratulations to uh, a little Vic Prodigy on his legendary status. Congratulations to Hershey, Miss Rahi, on his legendary status. Congratulations to uh, Tati Rodeo on her legendary status. Congratulations to the icon Kevin Mizrahi on his status and on his status. Congratulations to the icon Janice Mizrahi on her motherfucking status, Miss Thing. Congratulations. Um, oh my God, what's the uh? The Chanel boy name from uh, out there that got his status this weekend. I forgot his name. Derek. Congratulations to Derek on um his status. Um, let me see who else I remember. This live be freezing up and this live been freezing up and stuff tonight. But congratulations to everybody. There are uh, while the live was freezing up, but they announced some other people that got their statuses too. While the live was freezing up, uh, they announced some other people that got their statuses as well, Miss Thing. But you know, congratulations to everybody on their status, Miss Thing. I you know like. It's hard. It's it, it and and to everybody that's out there that uh can, oh yes congratulations to Kelly X Chanel I mean X Barmaine Miss Thing honey uh congratulations to her on her status Miss Thing and stuff like that. I got some other tea that uh, came across my desk, Miss Thing, but bitch, I'm not gonna talk about that, Miss Thing. Oh. We're gonna hold off on it, Miss Thing, girl. And when it does happen, Miss Thing, girl, I will definitely post up my screenshot and let the girls know that bitch. I was Mother T, Miss Thing, bitch, and I had the T, Miss Thing. So I'm going to hold off on that um, for now. Um, let me so see. what happened? Somebody else getting deemed or something? Uh, well, you know, you know, girls, you know, uh, no, it's not, it's not about girls, it's not about girls, it's not about girls getting deemed, Miss Thing, you know, I'm the type of girl, and it's no shade, Miss Thing, I'm the type of girl, Amaya, if I know a girl is coming out as mother and things of that nature, Miss Thing, I'm not gonna pump the tea, Miss Thing, I'm not gonna steal their shine and their glory, Miss Thing, I'm gonna... I'm gonna let them get their shine and I'm gonna let them get their glory. But bitch, I knew I knew the team. Wait, Kelly. Wait, Kelly X Barman was deemed No, she wasn't deemed icon, she was deemed legend. She was deemed legendary realness. She was deemed legendary she was deemed legendary realness. And to uh the legendary uh Berlin Ebony Mustang bitch. I don't know why you read TJ Ebony like that in that motherfucking post or motherfucking Facebook mistake. No, Girl, that no, was shady. No, 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 no. What? Kelly, Kelly. See, I, no, she got one. She went in the Hall of Fame. They didn't make her an icon. They put her in the Hall of Fame. Yeah, yeah, brother. Oh, okay. in the Hall of Fame. oh yeah, she's a legend and she's in the Hall of Fame. And I don't know why you read him like that on that oh, post, mistake. That was I, not. That was not nice. Now, bitch. <laughs> bitch, don't do that, mistake. Miss TJ been walking schoolboy, Miss Thing says schoolboy been schoolboy, Miss Thing. Don't you do her like that, Miss Thing. Honey. Girl, Kelly, shut up, girl, being fake on this motherfucking phone, girl. You didn't see DJ's status. I'm not going to let you sit on this phone and give it to Berlin, Miss Thing, and you sit up here being fake, girl. You didn't see it, girl. You privately read on the phone. Shut the fuck up. It's that, girl. Oh. You see? You see? Girl, you see? Girl, you see? What do you see, there, bitch? Miss Thing, that was, that, was a, that was a Tuesday through Sunday conversation, Miss Thing. You can't use Tuesday through Sunday conversation, Miss Thing. You can't use Tuesday through Sunday conversation, Miss Thing. We told you the rules, bitch. 
You see, bitch, I speak to you all day today, Miss Thing, bitch. I don't speak to none of these bitches on Monday, bitch, okay? Tuesday through Sunday, Miss Thing, bitch, is the rule. You can't be petty with Tuesday and Sunday tea, Miss Thing, on Monday, Miss Thing. We talk on Monday, you can talk, Miss Thing. That was Tuesday through Sunday, Miss Thing. You tried that, Miss Thing. But yeah, I didn't see it, Miss Thing. Girl, I'm just saying. Girl, listen. Honey. Bitch. But, uh, yo, let me tell you something. I really, I really, I really have fun. Like, yo, bitch, I had so much fun, bitch, trying to find different lives to watch the ball, Miss Thing, bitch. It was so many different angles and all types of shit. Like, no, bitch, I need a front angle, bitch, or I need a side angle, bitch. These bitches is going live from the back. If you in the back of the ball, Miss Thing, bitch, don't go live, bitch. Don't waste your battery and go live. If you're not in the side, in the side, up on the front, Miss Thing, bitch, don't go live from the back, Miss Thing. Nobody want to see. You can't see shit from the back. Don't go live. For real, bitch. Like you wasting your battery going live all the way from the back of the motherfucking room, Miss Thing, girl. What? You want to see a bitch walking onto the runway that ain't doing shit, Miss Thing, bitch? Stop wasting your battery doing stupid shit like that, Miss Thing. Like, really? Like I'm saying, y'all girls got to get it together. Get it together. Really. It just be it just be a mess, Miss Thing. Um, wait, um Oh, also also I also I gotta also say congratulations, congratulations to the House of Bar Main, Miss Thing. The House of Bar Main, congratulations to the House of Bar Main. They have secured the bag, Miss Thing, and they are house of the motherfucking year, Miss Thing. And I don't see so many posts up. Congratulations, congratulations to the House of Bar Main for the of the year, for the uh, House of the Year, Miss Thing, bitch. But I have not seen one person tag the overall mother in a post, Miss Thing, congratulating her for the house winning of the year, Miss Thing. I haven't seen one person tag her in a post. I'm just saying, for when they won of the year. I'm putting my phone back on mute. I'm putting my phone back on mute. You putting your phone on mute now? I'm just gagging, Miss Thing, bitch. I haven't seen one person tag her and say congratulations for y'all winning of the year. And they tagging everybody else, Miss Thing, but nobody has tagged her, Miss Thing. Girl, exit stage, exit stage left, Miss Thing. Seconds. Exit stage left, Miss Thing. We're going into record mode. So if you're on the phone lines, do not let this phone hang up because we got 90 seconds. If you want to be a part of this conversation, pick up the phone right now and call in to 563-999-3792, honey. We're going to be here for a few more minutes on record mode, baby, and, you know, and stuff like that. Oh, hold on. We got the legendary. We got the legendary one himself is back on the airwaves with us. Kyle Balenciaga. I mean, excuse me, Kyle Bar Man, you're live on the airwaves. Yeah, I just wanted to, just to correct you, Kelly, there are several polls that say congratulations, congratulating the overall mother for this on. People tagged her in Rodney's polls, they tagged her in Tayana's uh, polls, so she's definitely tagged. But she, she has so many Facebook names, we don't know which one to tag, but she definitely was tagged in several posts. Oh, I'm just saying, you know, I got, uh, you know, the girls, you know, the girls be sending me messages in my inbox. I'm just reading the message in my inbox. You know, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just here for clarity. I, I know they ask a lot of Yeah, you know, they be asking, they be asking questions and stuff. Seconds. Honey, so. But yeah, we here for the shit uh, and stuff like that and uh, things. Honey. Y'all better stop y'all. Y'all better stop y'all shit on the live. We are now in record mode, so don't let this phone hang up, honey. She got. Listen, y'all bitches better stop. Listen, y'all bitches better give up out my motherfucking inbox mistake, bitch. Okay, because they hear, they know it ain't me saying this stuff mistake. Cause they hearing these chinging and stuff coming through. That's why I leave my computer loud, bitch. Cause I don't want them to think that it's me saying it, mistake, honey. Okay, somebody says she got a main page and they paid her mistake, bitch. That's what they said. That's what they call it. Y'all hear the shit chinging, so don't think it's me saying this shit. Y'all hear my computer going off, okay? And I'm live, and I'm live on my motherfucking phone, Miss Thing, bitch. And y'all hear the computer going off, honey, so, bitch. Well, tell that person to, tell that person to press one. They said press one and call in. Are you here for the shit, or are you just here, honey? 
Oh, bitch. Uh, y'all here we go. They said, somebody just said, child, please. They paid her completely. Honey, y'all better stop this thing, girl. Y'all girls, y'all girls is a mess in this thing. Y'all better stop. Honey, okay? Tell me they said stop your shit. Whoa! Yeah, I, I'm not commenting because when well, it's just my sister, Rodney, it's my brother. I have nothing to say about this situation. I, I, I don't think that that everything is being spoken the way it is but the way it's the truth but I'm definitely not going to comment on something about my brother and my sister oh Baby, honey, oh, Lord, honey. Well, let me let y'all know something, Miss Thing, right? Let me let y'all know something, right? It's about to go down, Miss Thing, girl, okay? You know we don't do free advertisement around here, Miss Thing. But it's about to go down in a major motherfucking way in ballroom, Miss Thing, okay, bitch? Okay, it's about to go down. When I'm talking about it's about to go down in a major way in motherfucking ballroom, myself, Alexis Barmain, Felicity Barmain, motherfucking Kelly uh, 007, the overall, the overall uh, legendary mother, Toya Ebony, the overall mother, motherfucking Moni Khan, Miss Thing, the Balenciaga girls, Miss Thing, some of the Chanel girls, Miss Thing. It's about to go down in ballroom motherfucking history. Mona 007, Miss Thing. It's about to go down, Miss Thing, bitch. We are going to break the motherfucking internet, Miss Thing, like no motherfucking other, Miss Thing. It's about to be a category made for the big girls, Miss Thing, bitch. And we're all going to storm the motherfucking floor, bitch, and may the best bitch motherfucking win, bitch. And we're coming out, bitch, and we're not coming to play with the motherfucking girls, Miss Thing, bitch, okay? We're going to let ballroom know, bitch, why they should keep adding big girl categories on the motherfucking on category sheets, bitch, because we coming to shut it down, bitch, like it ain't never been shut down before, bitch. Oh, yes, bitch. We're going to show the girls we're here for the motherfucking shit, bitch. So stay tuned, bitch. The, Details are coming soon. And the girls better, and the girls better realize, girl, it's not taken as a house, bitch. It's every girl for herself that night. It's every bitch for they motherfucking self. And may the best bitch motherfucking win, bitch. Because best to believe, bitch, okay? I'm coming for you motherfucking hoes, mistake, bitch. Trust and believe, bitch. I'm coming for the hoes, mistake, bitch. And I'm not playing with the girls, mistake. I'm coming to wake the motherfucking building up, mistake, bitch. I'm to bitch, when I tell y'all, bitch, I'm coming, bitch. I'm coming, bitch. So I hope all the girls are ready, Miss Day. Because I want I want to see all the girls on the back of the floor, Miss Day. And then afterwards, after we finish battling and storming, bitch, we're going to have a nasty motherfucking photo shoot in the back of the motherfucking ball, Miss Day, bitch, with our nasty pictures, bitch. And the girls is going to motherfucking gag, bitch. Like all of those big bitches, Miss Day, bitch, was motherfucking sitting tonight. But only one bitch can walk away with the cash. I'm just saying. Okay, so y'all better be ready, bitch. But uh, we're going to get out of here. We're going to get up out of here. We're going to get up out of here. Um, Rodney and them don't have a show tonight because they're still they're still in Chicago and stuff. And uh, they have Vogue Nights in Chicago. So they don't have a show tonight. So um, Juicing with the Jays has canceled their show for tomorrow night and, uh, and let Tens of Chops do their show tomorrow night. So, um... Tens of Chops will be live on the air tomorrow night um, at 11 o'clock. So definitely tune in to Tens of Chops tomorrow so you can definitely get that side of how the ball was. Because all of them, the AARP committee, shouts out, wait, I got to shout out to Harold because he posted up, he posted up on his page that the AARP committee without having motherfucking brunch. So shout out to Harrow and the AARP committee. They will be live on the air tomorrow night, Miss Thang bitch, at 11 o'clock. So definitely tune into their show uh, tomorrow night. Don't forget um, this, uh, uh, don't forget in, um, in LA, it's coming up. It's the April Fool's Ball. Hold on, let me play, let me play the commercial for the April Fool's Ball before we get up out of here, honey, so y'all can get into it. Saturday, March 31st. Father Marcus and the Rocky present the April Fool's Ball. Saturday, March 31st, 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. Los Angeles, California. MC of the night, legendary Big Sean Nonsense. The categories include Grand Five, 
dollars open to all run back. One thousand dollars tag team performance. One thousand dollars twenty eighteen pieces only. Open to all street wear with an exclusive twenty eighteen sneaker. Mini grand prize. Five hundred dollars best dress. Five hundred dollars open to all realness. Five hundred dollars realness with a script. On the way. The April Fool's Ball, Saturday, March 31st, 10 p.m. to 4 a.m., Los Angeles, California. Yes, that was the April Fool's Ball, March 31st, in Los Angeles, California. Make sure you motherfucking there, because I'm going to be there, so make sure you're there. So everybody that's in L.A. that want to see the girl, Miss Thing, make sure you out, Miss Thing. I'm going to be in L.A. for a whole motherfucking week, bitch, so make sure you here for the shit. I'm in L.A. from uh, the 27th until the 3rd. I'm going to be in motherfucking L.A. So let's get it motherfucking popping. Let's get it motherfucking popping, Miss Thing, and let's get it down, Miss Thing. Girl, I'm going to be at the ball, Miss Thing. I'm going to be at the uh, club, Miss Miss Thing, bitch. I'm going to be at the club on the club that they have on Tuesday night. The ball, Miss Thing, that they have on Tuesday night. I'm going to be at the club on Friday night, Miss Thing. I'm going to be at the ball, Miss Thing, on Saturday, bitch. Then I'm going to be at the after party after that, Miss Thing, bitch. Then I'm going to be there on Sunday, Miss Thing, bitch. We're going out for brunch on Sunday, bitch. I'm going to do Petty Mondays from motherfucking L.A. on motherfucking Monday. And then I'm coming back home that following motherfucking Tuesday. So, bitch, make sure you there in L.A. for the shit because, bitch, I'm going to be in L.A. for the shit, bitch. So I hope to see you, girl girls in L.A. for the shit, and all the girls inside of L.A. that want to party and get it funky with mother, bitch, make sure you here for the shit. Jason, tell the girls good night. We about to get up out of here. Good night. Honey, and uh, Marcus, are you still here, Marcus? No, Marcus is gone, honey, baby. So thank you, Naima, for sitting in with us. Thank you, Mar uh, Marlon, for sitting in with us. Thank you, everybody, for coming in. And thank you, everybody that watched the live. Please make sure you follow my fan page, you share my fan page, because this is where it goes down when y'all want to hear the ratchet, when y'all want to hear the raw bitch, and y'all want me to give it to y'all. If you see me going live from my uh, or from my main my, from my page, baby, I'm going live only because I'm at a ball or I'm giving you just a simple conversation and a simple talk. But when you want the ratchet, you want the real and you want the raw, you can only get that right here on the Jess Kelly motherfucking fan page. Because you know why? Facebook has no censor over here on this page, bitch. So follow this page. Like this page. Share this page. Tell your girlfriend about this page if you bitches are really here for the motherfucking shit. I'll see y'all back here live on the air next week Monday for another installment of motherfucking Patty Mondays. I love y'all all for loving me. Whatever bathroom, whatever alleyway you definitely do go into, please make sure you practice safe sex because the life you save will definitely be your own. And to everybody that's asking about Erica, baby, Erica is on her way home really motherfucking soon and she's gonna sit down and we're gonna have an exclusive motherfucking interview with the one and only motherfucking Erica motherfucking King hashtag justice for motherfucking Erica baby I'll see y'all all, all. Mwah. good night